Bob Jones, who films our art group on a Thursday morning and then edits it and puts it on YouTube, has asked if I wouldn't mind um, showing how to do sheep. Uh, the backdrop here is Cadder Idris up in North Wales. And uh, sheep will give us a bit of life actually. And uh, cows tend to be angular, very square, or oblong. Uh, sheep more round, or think of uh, a rugby ball really. So if we start off with, say, a rugby ball at that sort of angle, and then if we think of another one, but more that angle there, and then let's put one that angle. So I'm thinking of roughly the shape of a rugby ball, just roughly, and I'm uh, going to put one upright there. And then I'll come in and just fine tune basically. I'll just um, so they're just at different angles. That's all I've done. And um, and now I've done that. What I'm going to do is get the rigger brush, which is a very sort of narrow, long brush, which is great for detail. And um, I'm just going to, uh, the light is um, coming from here, so this side then will be more in shadow. So I'm putting blue on that there, and over there, and over here again, and on this side as well. So I've started with the shape of a rugby ball, but then I'm sort of just adjusting it a little. Now then, if I get a good white now, this time now, that will come like that. And then this one be here. So you know you haven't got tails in or anything like that. It's just just a rough shape of what a sheep would be, but starting with like a a rugby ball, and then I'm coming lighter, and let's get that in there too, like that. Now then, what I'm going to do is get a green, a dark green, so yellow, more blue than than actual yellow, which makes it a darker, and let's see if that will work. So all that is basically now is like a cast, cast shadow, because the light is coming from this side. So that's stronger, that's better, that's, that's more what I wanted. And, um, and again, and up here, and up here, and there. So the light is coming from that side. And I might mix a blue with um, burnt sienna and just get a um, suggestion of, of a head in, that's all. It's only a suggestion. That's all it is. You wouldn't see legs at this stage. They'd be in the grass. You wouldn't see them. But now that is more or less, and what you can do is wait for for it to dry, the white to dry, and then the next white you put on will stand out even more, um, a lot more actually. So I'm tipping that down because the head's on the floor. And similarly with here, and here, now then. And what I might do is get suggestion of sheep. Just a suggestion here and there. Small, of course, they're in the distance, another field. That, that. I might do it. 
And then if I get that cast shadow color in, like a green, and keep it all going the same size, same way. And really, that's all there is to it. I could come back, like I say, when they dry, and I could get a better white in. It'll be sharper, crisper, just on the very end, like that, very end. I'm rushing ahead because I'm not leaving a chance to dry. Oh, well, that's better, that's better. And then, let's try here. That's better. And just a crisp, light catching the sheep there. And um, that's all there is to it, really. That's a sheep, and it's given a bit of life to the painting of Cabaret Dress.